I've been married for six years but with my partner Bruce. We met Alex actually three years ago when we opened up our relationship. We were just opening up our relationship because we had the level of trust that nobody else really had around us and we thought make our, our life a little more interesting. So we started to maybe go out and date and try it. We realized after a few months that we were looking for a deeper a deeper connection and something more than just a, you know, I mean, the odd hookup here and there. And when we met Alex, it just, it really clicked and we started out as friends. Being from a small town, I didn't know any gay people. So it was nice to meet other gay people when I moved to the city and just hanging out. And then slowly it just, it happened. None of us knew what polyamory really yeah, was. Yeah, it was, it was it a learning experience, like, especially three years ago, you've heard more about it now, even in the last year, than I've heard, you know what I mean, ever. I think experience really just, it's, it speaks more than, you know what I mean, a title. We all pick each other up in different areas, we all have different strengths and weaknesses that kind of, you know what I mean, fill in these gaps for each other, and that's the, the best part about it, is we have this, like, this feeling of family that we never really had, kind of, maybe from our own families growing up, that we've created for ourselves. People's biggest misconception is that we're constantly jealous all the time of each other and that can be farther from the truth because we're all equal and we all get what we need from each other. We were completely transparent about everything in our lives and I think that's the only way that a relationship like this would ever work. Even if I go do a video at the studio or someone else, I'm showing them everything. Every message, everything I do, I want them to be involved, I want them to know because it makes me feel better. I would say definitely like walk before you run, try not to go too quickly into it. I would say definitely try to open yourself up first, see if even a three-way, you know what I mean, lifestyle is something that you could imagine yourself doing. Maybe put yourself in some situations like that and maybe just do a little bit of research on it. Try to always be as honest as you can with your partners when you're going down this road because if you don't have that level of trust then you're not going to be successful, especially in a long relationship.